guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting for to episode 10 of season 2 of Love Live Superstars. It's gonna get started in 3, 2, 1, go. BTW, can we talk about the fact that, like, School Idol Festival All-Star, is it All-Star, yeah? Is getting another game, and now my, my baby Kanan is gonna be with us! It's gonna. It's really getting me back into wanting to play that game. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, but it's cold. Mm -mm. Drink. <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> Look <laughs> With the snow, best girl. Do they even have enough money to go all the way to Shanghai? She, she really went there. Can you work wrong with some of this season?
God, look at him, so cute! Oh. Of course these two be hanging out. <laughs> Getting distracted from games. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Hmm? No, don't say that, Kinoko. Yeah. Oh my god. Best girl used to feel all embarrassed every single time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love <laughs> I love everything about it, oh my god. Stuff happened. Yeah, and besides, this just says you're slowly but surely conquering your fear, best girl. What damn? <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
God, her eyes are so cold, but so pretty. Baby. God, hello, Cody. Ice fishing, of course. <laughs> She's right. <laughs> oh, damn. You all right?
Ooh, that's pretty. <gasps> Yay! Everything's done. You're right. Bitchy attitude and demeanor. I love it though, but at the same time, like, ah! It is the same song that she did before. I don't think so. Damn, they really went in on this production. I mean, ooh. Like, it, it's so weird when you really compare, like, a performance like this with, like, anything else from, like, any previous series for the show. Or, well, for Love Live in general. And just to see how much they've evolved over the years. Pretty song. Would like to hear the full version. You know, put that ish on Apple Music, iTunes, something. Cause oof, like I just felt something. Damn. Mhm. Cause she she knew she ate that. She knew she ate that ish. Mhm. And remember to have fun. Look at them, they look so gorgeous. Like, oh.
That was good. Ooh. Like, I don't, I got a little, we got a little gospel up ask in there. And I like that. Like, oh, that was good. I, I love the fact that I'm whispering over that, but seriously, that was good. But is it enough? I knew they were going to do that. I knew they were going to do that. Even though I was like, no, they're not going to do that. In my mind, I'm like, no, they're not going to cliffhanger me. They're not going to cliffhanger me again. Again. Oh, I'm scared. We got to wait until next Sunday. That's a long time from now. That's October 2nd. That's a long time. Especially with the fact is that I'm uh, we we in hurricane week for me. That's too long. Too freaking long. I need to know now. Can we just fast forward to next Sunday, please? I need to know. 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 But this song, both songs were really good. Like I said, Lilia's song gave me really interesting feels to, like, a lot of pop, Christian pop songs, but in a really good way. Like, oh my god. Because sometimes, like, with, with Christian pops, um, with some Christian pop songs that I used to listen to, uh... It either worked or it didn't work. Sometimes it was just, like, off. But, it, like, it just, that feeling, that warmth that you got, oh, my God. Like, I was, like, thinking, like, dang, oh, my God. Same thing with What's Your Face's song. Her song, once again, made me think of the Black Swan, like, part two. It's such, and I loved it. Like, uh, she, she oozes that energy so much, like, gracefully. She's just, like, ugh. Goddess, that's all I'll say. But I do love the fact that this episode, as for the girls, that it was more like, you know, let's still work hard towards something, but at the same time, you know, since we are working our butts off, we do need a break. I love how Conan was like, you know, today we're going to take a break. That sometimes we need to have a break. Look at my baby! Ah! Uh, look at her! Look at her! <laughs> That just caught on. Oh my god. With her girlfriend cheek. <laughs> Does that mean next week we're going to hear a, a con on version? Like, see, oh god, I, I cannot wait until we get the albums of the solo songs because since Conan is my best girl and I love her so much, um, it's like how when Nozamine. Um, for, for Muse, when they finally released, like, the solo version of every song for Muse, and I got to hear Nozamine just sing by herself, I was so happy, because as much as I love everyone, Nozamine is my best girl. And, I oh, look at <laughs> oh, I need that! I need a screenshot of that! Oh my god, look at her, she's so... She just, uh, the, and, uh, my baby, she oozes so much positivity and energy, and I just love her so much. She's so precious, and it's just so weird. See, I'm about to tear over this damn child to see how far she's come. Like, like oh my god, once again, she accomplished something in today's episode. I mean, she literally was like, I'm going to stand my ground and, you know, be on camera and say stuff. But then at the same time, she's like, oh, my God, I don't like I like doing this. And that reminds me of how scared I was when I was first doing YouTube. Because let me tell you, doing YouTube, like, at first, the, like, when you're doing it, like, for the first time and you're trying to get to your first 100 subscribers or even to your first 1,000, I will always say that, yes, that journey to your first 100, your first 1,000 is the toughest journey. But if you can truly make those two um mark points in your youtube career then you can do anything that comes up to your mind it's just about being dedicated don't always think about like the fame and the fortune and everything do it because you love it i've seen and um talk to people in the past about it where like people have asked me like well what do you do on this and i'm like you know sometimes even when i'm tired and i am deadbeat you know 
coming home from work and I have no energy. Sometimes I have to pick myself up and just say, fuck it, get it done. And Kanan is one of those type of characters where she's like, I have to get this done. And she just looks so pretty. Look at her. Oh my god. But if we get that next week, if we get a Kanan version of the song that she, sang, that she just sang, I'm going to cry. Okay? Okay. But yes, that's like how I think for, I don't know if they've done it for like Aquas, if they've done like the solo song as album. Like I'm waiting for that with Johanne. I, I most certainly am. And then for, um, for, uh, not, yeah, Nijikasaki. Nijikasaki's, it's kind of really everybody's solo. I, I don't know. Cause I love everybody in that show. Really? I mean, I do, Col Col yeah, Kanata, Kanata's my best girl, because we all know Nezuko, but really, the day that this group finally gets their character solo songs, and gets to have every single song as a solo for what they've done in their um, musical career and such, I think that's going to be like the greatest day, because her voice is it, just... It's so good, and it makes me almost want to cry every single time. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode 10 of season 2 of Love Live Superstar. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all on Sunday for episode 11. Bye, guys.